Field Day in Hermitage began more than a century ago. It was a way to commemorate Frank and Julia Buell for their contributions to the area. The celebration didn't go on for a number of years, and then it was brought back to the area. Today, many gathered to celebrate Labor Day as well as 40 years of Field Day celebrations. People aren't just celebrating Labor Day here in Hermitage. They're also celebrating 40 years of the Buell Day celebrations. They're enjoying food, entertainment, and time with family and friends. Frank and Julia Buell, who donated this lovely park to the community, uh, wanted to have a picnic in the park for the community. Hence, Buell Day was born. Lasted until the beginning of World War II, and then it stopped for about 30 years. Sue McLaughlin is the secretary for the Buell Day Committee. She said that Buell Day is all about the community. The idea was brought back around 1979. Last year would have been 40 years. However, COVID-19 changed those plans. The co-chairman said that it's a wonderful way to bring people together. Music is love and love is music if you know what I mean. It is the place where you come on Buell Day, otherwise known as Labor Day, to other people. Not in this community. No, no. in this community it is Buell Day and there will be several thousand people here. For money, they have been coming to Buell Day for years. They keep coming back because of the community aspect. Oh, I think it's the community. Without any doubt, the people that come out, it's always a great crowd. We get a following that come back every year. Larry Schuler and his wife Jerry have been vendors at Buell Day for about eight years now. They said that the fantastic community members keep them coming back. In Hermitage, Megan Lee, WKBN 27 First News.